Hi, I'm Ollie. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at the Samsung S3 Genuine Extended Battery Kit. So this battery kit is available in three colours. This is the packaging. You've got white, you've got blue, and you've also got black. So it's a 3,000 milliamp an hour battery. The uh, the standard battery, which I'll uh, just show you now. So this is the uh, standard battery. It's 2,100, so you're getting 3,000 of the capacity of this. I'll just pop that out the uh, the cover that it comes in. Just give you a quick comparison with the original battery. Adds about 30 grams in weight. The uh, looking at it next side by side, it does actually make it look quite a bit thicker. Um, but the thing I like about this kit, other than being a, a genuine Samsung kit, is it doesn't actually add too much bolt to the phone. So you get a new back. So if I just compare these, it's about three and a half millimeters that actually adds to the phone. So what I'll do, just put that to one side, pop this in. So the way I look at this uh, this battery. Uh, if you're like me and towards the end of the day if you've had a heavy day's use on your s3 you do find that the uh, the battery is running really really low so say for example you get about nine hours heavy use out of it you're going to add about another four hours heavy use onto the uh, the actual phone itself so this clips on as it's a, uh, a genuine samsung battery kit you can be reassured the uh, the back cover is uh, probably even better quality than the original one because we've all had issues with the original one cracking so I'll just give you a quick look round so normally you sit pretty much across there and a quick look around the phone. So in the, even though it does seem like the back bulges out quite a bit, it doesn't actually feel that much different in the hand. You can just pretty much feel the curvature at the back. The weight difference doesn't even stand out at all. If I just use my uh, Nexus 4 to give you a side-by-side -side comparison, you can see it's not really that thick. It comes out just over 11 millimeters, whereas the phone I believe is 8.9 as standard. If I just show you around the camera there, you can see that there is actually that little ridge running round. The uh, the flash isn't affected, which is good. So the camera's not going to be affected the way it recesses away. You've still got the Samsung logo, so you're not. Uh, it's not any different. Obviously, this back's quite old now on this phone, so if anything, this one looks even better. The, uh, the big question is what cases is it compatible with i've tried a few i've got doesn't seem to fit in any of those because of the uh, the extra bulks or any snap on cases you might find that a pouch will still work i have tried a few docks the uh, the genuine hdmi dock works absolutely fine and also some of the uh, the cover mount ones work fine because it doesn't add too much bulk at the bottom there it just slips on nicely so the uh, the next thing for me to find out is which cases are going to be compatible with this so i'll uh, i'll try and put a video review together of those asap obviously no problems there with the headphone jack like i said it's about 30 grams in weight so it still keeps the uh, the s3 nice and lightweight and i think this will be perfect if you're one of those users where uh, by the end of the day you've got 40 percent left on your battery you're probably going to get two days use out of it if you like me you get towards the end of the day and by midnight you really need to charge your battery you'll uh, you'll find that you can uh, you can use it heavier than ever before and still have a lot of charge left in there let's give you one quick last look at the battery itself you can see where it sticks out there obviously the, uh, the standard charger still works absolutely fine with it it is going to take a bit longer to charge uh, normally find that it's pretty much coming up to two hours so you're probably going to find nearly three hours with this battery um, but all in all for the money and being a genuine Sam samsung product it's highly recommended so if you're interested in samsung s3 case reviews or tips or anything subscribe to my channel and i'll keep you updated i'm still doing uh, plenty every week on those there's already plenty on there as well if this video has helped if you could like it on youtube it would be much appreciated any questions about the product ask below and i'll pop a link in there so if you're interested in checking out further description you can follow that link and uh, thanks a lot for watching the video